Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Savera. I make cute clay stuff to keep my inner child alive and hopefully give you all a serotonin boost. Welcome back to another vlog of an introvert artist. Before I start making the clay stuff for my mirror, there are so many days and nights that I have spent in my room. Sometimes making art and sometimes making content or sometimes searching some inspiration for my clay stuff from Pinterest. Sometimes unboxing new things, making new things and while I used to think that all of this is so difficult and loneliness might be my biggest enemy. I later realized that loneliness might be a friend that is often misunderstood. I have said this in so many of my videos that I am kind of like an introvert person and it's difficult for me to go out and meet new people, make new friends and what I am trying to say is that I realize it's fine sometimes to be alone and enjoy the alone time. You don't have to go out every single day and try to be an extrovert. If that's something that is making you anxious and so with today's video I want to share how being alone helped me with my crafting things and also made me feel closer to my art. I just want to share my perception of it because at, as I said I think it's often misunderstood and so with that let's get started. For making today's clay stuff for my mirror, I have chosen some of the most easiest design that I could possibly think of which is very different to my other craft because usually I do like drawing and a lot of other stuff but today I have chosen easy really simple design and I want to try something new and simple. I have never made clay stuff before even though it is so popular in the clay community and so I thought maybe I should give it a try. I still feel like that it could have been a lot better because I experienced a lot of cracks on this piece but I still think that I could have made them a little better and so for that I need to experiment a little bit more but honestly I was not too tense to make them really perfect because I am not going to sell them. It's just me experimenting with new things and trying out new styles and I know that this will help me in future. When I try to make more clay stuff so I think it's so important that sometimes you need to make time for yourself and just let your creativity shine. Do new things, do what you enjoyed without anyone judging you. And so in these moments, being alone is one of the best thing for me. Because I will be honest with you guys, even though I have been crafting for more than one year. Now, if somebody is watching me making craft things, I will mess it up. And that's why I am very hesitant to even do lives. I get very nervous because after all, I am a person that who are introvert artists sometimes. It's okay. Let's your creativity shine all alone without showing it off to everyone. When I moved into a new city, I grew up and spent my 20 years with my sister and then she married that was really hard for me. I struggling to make new friends in my university as well even though I have a friend group. I always felt like I am that one who is always left out of all the conversations and to be honest I found their conversation very boring. Things that they discussed was not something I was really interested in. But 
I realize I don't have to face my opinion on things that I find boring and instead I will just doodle some cute stuff on my notebook and of course at first it was uncomfortable and difficult but as time went by I realized that loneliness is not a lack of connection but instead it's a chance to connect with yourself so through the whole video i was just telling you about being alone and how it's beautiful to be alone but am i really alone i mean i am really lucky to have parents with whom i can share most of my feelings so just to be clear i am not saying you to abandon all of your friends and just be lonely i am just saying that if you find yourself not fitting in a particular friend group then maybe try enjoying your time alone I was just chatting with you guys the sun is almost down and I am just going to let these babies rest on my mirror the design are almost done last step is to set these stuffs in the mirror this is finally how my mirror turned out to be honest it look like so cute it is just make me feel happy when i looked at this and when i looked myself in this cute and little mirror and please please let me know which is your favorite design i hope you guys enjoyed today video i will see you guys in the next video take care of yourself bye bye